So they let you into Canada. Oh, this fucking guy. Yeah, man. Fucking here. It was actually really easy to get in here. Really easy. Yeah. Sean, uh, Neil Davidson from the Canadian press. Welcome mm. to Canada. Oh, congratulations. <laughs> yeah. Fucking the Canadian press, man. Were you a, uh, were you a, uh, a COVID bank account still or two? Were you on board with that? No. I, uh, Are you left wing or right wing? Were you a, tr- were you a Trudeau? We got one of the, we got one of the fucking commies with a press. We got to know where this man stands. Were you non-biased? I think I'll ask the questions here. Oh, he thinks he'll ask. Oh, we fucking know. Maybe I should just pass on this motherfucker. He's going to go back. He's going to go back and fucking give my bank account information to fucking Trudeau. <laughs> well, it's probably a good bank account. Uh, uh, I wanted to ask you about what really. life has been like as a champion. I'm sure there have been a lot of pluses, but maybe a few minuses. You're, you're in the public eye now. What, what has it been like in the short time since you've had the belt? Oh, man. Ah, uh, fucking guys, nothing changes, man. You go to Walmart, you get recognized more, but like, you know, my bank account's a little bigger. I mean, it's a little bigger. It's not much bigger. It was a little bigger. I'm not going to fucking retire after this one, win or lose, you know? <laughs> I'm not going to go lay in a fucking bathtub with flower petals, but I don't know, man. It's like, do you guys think that you get a belt and like everything changes? Like, what do you think happens? Like, I get a belt and everything, like all of a sudden, like my dick's made of gold. Like, what do you guys think happens? I get like, what do you think? You know, nothing changes. I'm still the same asshole. I just have this the metal. I don't, I'm sure it's not even gold. I just have a fucking metal gold plated belt in front of me. <laughs> hey, Sean, over here. Um, I saw you train with Johnny Eblen. Oh, this fight. he's a Canadian. That's right. Yeah. You're not a dirty liberal, though. I've known you for a while. You don't ruin our friendship. Are you a fucking liberal? I'm not a liberal. No. Okay. I didn't vote for Trudeau. Um, Johnny Eblen, uh, what was it like in a train with Well, you say you're a liberal for Trudeau. No, no, no. I said I was. I, I did not vote for Trudeau. Oh, there we go. This guy's the fucking man. This not the guy. This guy's for the fucking opposition, man. Who, who gave this guy a fucking press badge? And, like, you look at me, and I'm an asshole. I'm making fun of this liberal fuck, you know? Like... <laughs> No offense, man. I mean, you know, we, we all, we, I guess we need fucking liberals, you know, um, kind of, maybe, maybe not, but you look at me and I say hard shit. Like I make fun of my co-main event. I say hard shit. I'm like, Oh, Sean, I'm not an asshole. I'm fucking, I say everything. I'm just saying what you're thinking. Um, I did want to ask, you know, you're in Toronto. Welcome. Glad to hear it. It's been great. Are you Canadian? Uh, of course I am. Are you part of the fucking opposition? Are uh, you, uh, I don't know how to phrase that. You, I mean, you got like fucking, oh, yeah. well, I did want to ask, you did know, you vote for Trudeau? Uh, you know, I'm not going to say. And, and let me tell you something right now. If a man says he's not going to say, like, if you ask a motherfucker, did you vote for Biden? He's like, well, I'm not going to say that's none of your business. He voted for fucking Biden. Sean, so, hey, Sean, I'm glad you've had great experience. So this is, our, this but, is what I'm talking about, you guys. The enemy, the enemy of Canada. Sure, sure. All right. That's what it's got to be. It's got to be. Yeah. Uh, we've got a pretty supportive gay and lesbian yeah. community in this city. I did want to ask you about something you wrote a couple of years ago. You said, if I had a gay son, I would think. I'd oh, look, another, another, and, this, I'm saying the, the swamp, you guys, the swamp. You become a champion, you become a star. And, and someone let me ask model. you something are you, you are you are chance, you gay have are, you had the chance no to are, interact with are, a more diverse are you of, let me know are, are you gay can i hear can i get an answer well no, i'm asking I'm, this is a part of the, are you are you a gay man i'm an ally of the community okay if you had a son and he was like you know you had a son he was gay you'd be like oh man you don't you don't want a grandkid no problem with it oh man well you, dude you're a weak fucking man dude you're like you're part of the fucking problem you elected justin trudeau like would you fucking when he sees the bank accounts like you're just fucking pathetic and and the fact that the fact that you have no fucking backbone and and has he shut down your fucking country and seized bank accounts? You ask me some stupid shit like that? Go fuck yourself. Move the fuck on, man. I feel like that doesn't really coward. answer the question, but I did want to ask also things you said about the trans community. You said uh, this past October when they announced the Bud Light sponsorship that you'd go so hard on Bud Light in your next fight, they'll have to accept me or denounce me when uh, when they know what and we'll know what they stand for. Are you this still guy's like, hey, this Canadian's not that Canadian. Are you still going to use your fight time to kind of speak on that? Here's the thing about Bud Light. Here's the thing about Bud Light. Ten years ago, to be trans was a, what, a mental fucking illness. And now all of a sudden, people like you have fucking weaseled your way in the world. You are, you are an infection. You are the definition of weakness. Everything that is wrong with the world is because of fucking you. And the best thing is, is the world's not buying it. The world's not buying your fucking bullshit you're fucking peddling. The world is not saying, you know what? You're right. Fucking chicks have dicks. The world's not saying that. The world's saying, no, there are two genders. I don't want my kids being taught about, you know, who they could fuck in school. I don't want my kids being taught about, you know, their sexual preference. Like, dude, this guy is the fucking enemy 
Uh, you want to look at the fucking enemy to our world? It's that motherfucker right there asking these stupid fucking questions. Sorry, I, I, I told the UFC I was being nicer. Lance, if, Lance, am I am I still good with this? Am I, did I cross any lines? A little, what the fuck? I didn't say the F word. You just brought this fucking guy in here to piss me off. You, you just did, but... Uh... Just to follow up, I mean, Rick. Wait, did I wait? Did I say the? Did I say it? You just did. No, I didn't say it. Right, right there, you did. Oh, different different effort, different. Yeah. yeah, I'm trying to be good, man. I'm trying to be good. I do. I like the fucking gays. Here's thing. I've never. You, you guys think I've ever shit on a gay man or shit on a gay woman? I don't fucking. I like the gays. It's, it's a, it's, it's fucking freedom. We still have it in America. We'll teach you about. It. You guys don't have fucking freedom of speech. I'm surprised what I'm saying is probably gonna get fucking. I'm probably gonna get the fucking uh, Canadian government to arrest me. So, I don't give a fuck who you fuck. I don't give a fuck what you want to do in life. But, but, don't fucking tell kids about it. Don't teach that shit in fucking school. Don't, don't fucking push your agenda. Don't try to fucking brainwash people. Don't try to go past parents. Don't try to go up past all this shit and brainwash people, you fucking cuck. And last thing, mm-hmm. Australia last time, Canada this time. Where yeah, they, no. Where are they going to send you next? Fuck, you at least go? maybe a, maybe a country with fucking freedom of speech. I want to talk to this fucking guy. So where? What's what's your fucking America, like? Vegas, America. bro? Like anywhere in America? Fucking a. I mean, I get. I, I like. <clears throat> here's the thing about Canadians, guys. I love Canadians. I've never met a Canadian that I didn't like until today. You know, I've never. Every time I meet a Canadian, they love guns. They love fucking freedom. They like women, and I keep thinking. How come all these Canadians I know, how is Canadian Canada so fucked up when all these Canadians I meet are awesome and I meet this fucking guy and I just think there might be a lot more of these guys I don't know about.